If you've ever felt like a pressure cooker ready to burst, especially at this time of year, you know it's time to relieve the stress. Now, a new way to blow off steam is to head to a rage release room. But before you do, here are three things you need to know. Number one, what is a rage release room? It's a safe place to lose control. Steve Wilk owns Simply Smashing Rage Release Room in Tempe, Arizona, and he tells us what all the rage is about. How did you get the idea for a rage room? I was watching the Blues Brothers movie. The classic? Yes, where they're driving the car through the mall, crashing through all the glass <laughs> and the crystal and everything. And I thought to myself, oh my goodness, those actors get to do things that the rest of us would absolutely love to do. When the idea came to you, you were in traditional therapy. At the time, yes. I didn't have a place at the time to do anything like this. It, it didn't exist, but I thought it'd be fun and a nice outlet for people. Next, so what do you do in a rage release room? You wear coveralls to protect yourself. You wear a visor to protect your face. Right. And gloves, and then you're all set to go. I'm not an angry person. I'm an anxious person. But I do see a toy over there, and I would like to get even. Prices for one person start at 28 bucks, which gets you 12 breakables and the option to buy more. Pay for jail! Six. And number three, it's all about how you feel when you're done. I do feel pretty good. I see why people like this. To better understand this phenomenon, we asked psychologist Dr. Joanna Jablonski what she thinks of these rage release rooms. It's a forbidden fruit, you know, the things that you can usually do. And now this allows you to kind of go and relieve your anger and your stress and your rage. Be a little bit aggressive without getting in trouble. But Dr. Jablonski also says that this shouldn't be the only outlet for rage and frustration. I think going to either group or individual therapy to kind of figure out where is this anger coming from. And also, you know, the gym, going for a walk, swimming, maybe getting a massage. Smashing stuff and getting a massage, the perfect combination. Taking a swing in anger management on the top of the list.